Today we're gonna to see if we can turn a team like this into a team like this in only seven days of FIFA. The rules are simple. We either have to climb the divisions all the way to division one, or we have to get a rank two minimum in fuck champs. And if we don't achieve this, the entire team is gonna to have to go into a gold upgrade. So it's time for us to start our journey and I picked France as the starter nation, Kingsley Coman as the lone player. And then we have to go and pick our kits. I picked the two most expensive kits, Real Madrid and Mexico, and also the most expensive crest in Barcelona. And then we went to the store. We had no packs in the store. Then we had the quarterfinals pack, which they did grant us. We managed to get this out of the pack. We were then able to sell both of the kits for 5,000 coins, which was always going to be a massive help. And then we completed the foundations SBCs so we could go ahead and get into the player SBCs. I then decided to go do the daily bronze upgrade and the daily silver upgrade. And what this was going to allow me to do was turn all of the bronzes into silvers and all of the silvers into gold commas, which could allow us to do some player picks. We then started to open our silver packs and we managed to get a special in this one, Fuck Fancy Miller, and then also another special, Fuck Fancy again, Christian Benteke. So the first set of player picks were now upon us. I've got more, but I need to open these first of all. And I'm going to hope that we do get some good specials. Starting off with Rashford is okay for the club straight away. And we've got a special coming in here of Emil Forsberg. Good fodder. Probably good for the first games of division rivals. And then the final one is going to have David Alaba in it. That's really not too bad. And now another three player picks to be added into the club first. We're going to start with Diego Carlos, 95. Now, what you've got to remember, guys, we haven't even played a game yet. And we've got Diego Carlos already in the club. We're also adding Ndidi there, 84 rated fodder. And then the final one for this set is going to have Kieran Trippier in it. Oh, my God. We've just gone and got Zinjenko, 90 rated from one of the gold common packs that we were grinding. That is absolutely insane. So, the final set of player picks that we're able to do right now. What are they going to give us? We're going to start with Pacino, which is good fodder once again. I thought Pogba was going to be the option there. But we've got an 87 rated. And then we're going to have Cobell, a nice goalkeeper. I don't think we actually have a goalkeeper right now, so that's nice. And then the final player pick is going to have Dusan Talic in it. Not too bad again there. So before even playing a game and just grinding the menus, this is the team that we've been able to put together. I think it's absolutely incredible. I then decided to start going into division rivals and getting some rage quits and lots and lots and lots of goals. As you can see here, absolutely tearing this guy apart. We did manage to make him rage quit. We then got some more rage quits as well, which is amazing. And before you could say nine, we were in Division Nine. In Division Nine, we were able to get some more rage quits, which meant we got into Division Eight even quicker. And then we were able to get ourselves into Division Eight, which was absolutely amazing. We've got rage quits all the way through so far. It's becoming very, very easy. Hopefully, we get all the objective players done very soon. With me grinding through rivals, we managed to go and get Anaki Williams, Futties, 93 rated. And then we also added Bradley Danger's 93 Futties. Whilst we also added Danger and Anaki Williams, EA granted us a really, really nice objective in Division Rivals, which was just play nine games and you'll get rewarded with all of these packs, including an 85 times 10 pack. So we're going to go and open these all now and hopefully get some more Futties cards into the club. We're going to start off with a future stars in the first pack. It's going to be Willock from Newcastle, I believe, in this one. Which is all right. That's good fodder once again. That will all be used as fodder right there for some sort of Futties card. We've got the 81 plus times 11. Should get some specials in this. It's going to be another future stars. It's going to be Ica Bravo. No, it's Fran Garcia. Also plays for Real Madrid, I do believe. Now, anything else in here? It's a pretty damn bad pack, but once again, you've got that fodder there with Ricky Puig and Angelino, which isn't too bad. We'll discard the Ricardo Pereira. We're not going to need him, especially on a seven-day RTG. We're going to get so much done. 10, 82-plus players. It's going to be a Europa League. Brazil, left mid. It's going to be Gabriel Martellini's 91, which actually isn't that bad. And then we've, oh, we've got Ricardo Pereira again. That's not too bad, honestly. Once again, fodder is very nice. We're going to go and grind all three Team of the Week tradable packs after this because they're all 30k each. So it's going to be quite easy to do that and get some coins into the club. We've also got a Team of the Week out of this, which is amazing. It's going to be Jonathan David. I'm pretty happy with that. Getting the Team of the Weeks in the club right now are really valuable. So to add him in is really nice. DeMarcus in there as well and Fran Garcia. They weren't the best for us. So then we went and grinded all three of the tradable Team of the Week packs. And of course, these are very, very good right now because Team of the Weeks are quite high in demand and there's not a lot of them in packs. So you can make a lot of coins from these. You can sell them all for 30,000 coins minimum. 
as I was recording this, which was great for the coin balance. And look at that, all three of them have sold for max bid, which means we've got 100,000 coins already. This is how the team was looking before we went into the Butties Cup. I want to go and get Thomas Lamar and I want all of the fodder packs as well, so we're gonna go and grind that out now. I then went and added Kula Bali's 96 rated into the club before he expired at 6 p.m. So we were six games into the Butties Cup and we managed to get Jaime from the objectives for it. And we've also got all of the packs to open now as well. And then we've also got to make a decision between Alexander Isaac or the 85 times five, or is it the 84 times five? I'm obviously gonna take the pack. We need all the fodder we can get. Let's go over to the store and open up all these packs. So now we've got all of the packs to open. I'm hoping just for fodder here. Maybe a Futties card would be absolutely amazing. I'm not really expecting too much, but as I said, any fodder is certainly very valuable for us. So I'm keeping my fingers crossed that we are gonna get a fair amount of that. We've got the free 83 plus players pack. Come on, specials. Oh, no specials. Really? Lloris in there and Sergio Ramos with Handanovic is not too bad. Then we've got an 83 times, no, not an 83. It's an 85 times three, I should say. It's gonna be English, center back, it's gonna be Gehi, is that right? 88 rated fodder is very, very nice at this stage. We've also got Ricky Puig in there. Oh, I need to put him into an SPC, I'll bring you back. So I decided to put Ricky Puig in to Javier Hernandez, another card joining the club. There we go, both from LA Galaxy, what a coincidence. And then the final pack is going to be the 84 times five. Come on, lots of specials. It's gonna be a future stars to come out straight away. It's gonna be bad, it's gonna be that Rangers striker. That's really, really bad. Please have some other fodder in here. Oh, that is such a bad pack. After grinding another six games of the Futties Cup and going 6-0, so we're 12-0 right now, we've added Vine Dow into the club and also Musa, two great upgrades to the squad. And also with that, we also get two monster packs to help upgrade our team and go and do some SBC. So first of all, we're going to start off with a fuck birthday in this pack. It's going to be Brazilian. It's going to be Alex Tellers. He's not going to displace Zinjenko. zinjenko has been brilliant for us. And of course, we've now got Vindal in the club as well. That really wasn't too good a pack, to be fair. And we've got the five times 85 plus players pack. This has got some good specials in it, surely. Oh, it's the same guy from Rangers, the striker, American. Wow, our packs have been bad. We then decided to add a midfielder into the team, and that is going to be Ivan Perisic. This guy's going to be really good for us. You know, midfielders aren't there a lot right now in terms of cards as SBCs. So to get Perisic into the club, is really, really nice, and it's gonna be a nice addition in to the midfield for us. So this was the new look team after just 10 hours of playing the game, absolutely crazy. We're gonna upgrade the cam for Lamar once we've got the Futties Cup done, and we're also gonna go and get Ant-Man. I have now completed the Futties Cup, and we didn't lose a single game. We went 15 and 0 in the Futties Cup, which was absolutely amazing. We've got the 85 times 10, and we've also got Thomas Lamar joining into the club which is a massive, massive card to bring in. Here is the 85 times 10 then. Futties, please. Oh, it's gonna be a Champions League card. It's going to be Varela. No, Rapsidori, I do believe, yep. Rapsidori and that, who else have we got in the pack? Well, it's a pretty bad 85 times 10, actually. So with the fodder we had in the club from doing the Fatties Cup, I decided to go and complete Petr Cech. He is going to be such a good player for us. And then only two days into this account, this is the team that we did have. How crazy of a team is this? So with that, guys, we went back into Division Rivals and we were getting Rage Quit on Rage Quit on Rage Quit, trying to get up the divisions to get qualified for Fat Champs. All right then, guys, and with that Rage Quit, we are now in Division 6. It's very easy. You know, we've had so many Rage Quits. Petr Cech is heavily heavily carrying us as i was expecting him to but now we're in division six and nearly qualified for fuck champs so guys we've also managed to add ant-man into the club i actually do quite like the look of this guy's card so i might go into the team and then fellas we've got a pick between modric's team of the year or the 85 times 10 i'm not gonna go for the 85 times 10 again i want the follow on my account we'll go and open that shortly All right then guys 85 times 10 at number three maybe number four now we've got a future stars in it who is it going to be it's gonna be brazilian it's going to be CDM. I've already got him in the club, unfortunately. So we're going to need to put him into an SBC. First, we got in here. It's once again, another really bad 85 times 10. There is some good fodder in there. But generally speaking, that is awful once again. So now it was Futty's Team 4, which meant EA granted us a free 85 times 10 pack. We're going to open that right now. And we're going to probably have to go and grind Draft because Draft has some really, really cool rewards at the moment. I'll show you shortly. We've got El Shuari as a walkout. In our 85 times 10, anything else special in here? Lots of very good fodder. 
Let's go and take a look at draft. All right, then, guys, that's us through the first draft. We managed to go and get three draft tokens. What are we going to get for our first rewards? Pretty poor with two 25k packs and two 5k packs. It was then time for us to add Jesper Carlson in from the draft objectives. He is probably going to be fodder. He looks quite good, but I don't think he'll be anything other than fodder for the 82 times 100. So draft win number two is in a very, very difficult final. I'm not gonna show you it, it was too stressful, but we managed to get the second draft win in. What are we gonna get for our rewards? Hopefully something good, it's the same reward as last time. That's very tough. Our newest recruit to the team is going to be Santos. He looks absolutely brilliant. What a card he is, I've never heard of him. But his card is absolutely amazing. So for the final draft, this is the squad that we did build. Hopefully we can go and get it. I don't want to go into another draft. I want to get it done in this one. Let's get into the gameplay. Oh, Mbappe, that's a beautiful goal. What a finish. Eusebio's in here too. Into Mbappe. Mbappe makes it 2-0. Let's go. This guy's going to rage quick probably. Let's get into the second game. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Go on then, Haaland. Yes, let's go, Haaland. Oh, that's lovely football, that. Oh, your Torre isn't going to miss that. 2-1. We've turned the game around very quickly there. Nice. Oh, that touch from Mbappe. Oh, my God. What a goal. Another rage quick coming in here? Yes, it is. And finally, lads, that game was over. This dude just did not want to leave. He stopped playing for a while. But happily, finally, we're into the final of the final draft as well. Hopefully that we're going to have to play as long as we don't lose. Yes, Mbappe. Yes, come on. First goal in the final. Ooh. That's a penalty. Wow. Liquid football from me, to be fair. Hopefully we can score the pen. Come on, Van Percy. Yes, good penalty. Oh. Oh, it's beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. Eight minutes in to the final. And we've got the final rage quit, which means we get Gakpo and Delaney and lots of fodder packs. So what are we going to get for our rewards? Probably the same set. I wouldn't be surprised by that. Now we're going to get a premium gold players pack and a mega pack. We're going to go and open that now. And then we're going to go and claim all of our objectives. Hopefully these will have some good rewards in here for us. Because it would be nice to go and get some coins for Nanny. We're going to get a fuck fantasy in the first one. It's going to be English. Cam, it's going to be Deli Alley there. 89 rate is a good fodder. Or we can sell him if we want to. Romero in there as well. Not too good, but still nice fodder to add into the club. And then the Mega Pack is going to contain for us a special card. No, not even boards up, unfortunately. Let's go and claim our objectives. So with that, that means that we have completed the Futties draft objectives, which is going to give us Delaney's 94 rated premium Futties as well. He looks really, really nice. And then we also get a 5 times 85 plus for the 12th win. And of course, the group reward is going to be Cody Gakpo. Pretty happy to pick him up. He looks really good. Five star skills on him as well. Six foot two. He's probably going to go straight into the team. Gakpo! Really like the look at this card. Happy to get the draft objectives done that quickly as well. The first of hopefully many cover star icons has now joined the club in pool skulls. Obviously quite a grindy objective. But not only that, we've managed to get ourselves into Division 4, which is absolutely amazing this early. You know, we need to get to Division 1 to beat FIFA. We're only three days into the account, so this is very, very good this early on. Whilst we also completed Skulls and got into Division 4, we got a 50k pack, which is an objective that's been in the game since basically day one. We're going to open this now. We need to go and get loads of fodder now because we need to start completing SBCs. I want to go and get, I think, Rooney and Roberto Carlos, cover star icons. I don't know if it's going to be possible. Might not be able to go and get the fodder. That's a really bad 50k pack, by the way. Then we also got gifted from EA some packs for playing in Division Rivals. So they're not bad packs, actually. There's an 84 or 85 times 10 near the back end as well. So let's open this free 84 plus players pack. We're going to get a fuck birthday in it. Who is that going to be? Spain. Sentiment. Is that Koke? I think that's Koke there. So a full special pack, which is really, really nice. And they're going to be good fodder. You know, not to get any duplicates right now is very good too 81 times 11 come on EA oh it's not even got any specials in it it's going to be Galatsky as the walkout or the board I should say oh that's bad that's really bad and then we've also got a 10 82 plus players pack this should have some specials in it it's going to be a future stars it's going to be English right wing back it's going to be Jed Spence which really isn't very good no Fatty's cards really packed yet we've got Tillman again Modric and Kalinoglu. 
I'm gonna go through them into something and I'll bring you back for the 85 times 10. So we're submitting this into the 88 rated squad for the 82 times 100. I'm not too bothered about any of the cards in there. You know, the fuzzies cards that we do have were a means to an end. So we are one squad away now from the 82 times 100. And here is the 85 times 10 from the rivals objective. Just want lots of fodder and probably Oblak. Team of the year in this. It's gonna be French, left back. It's gonna be Theo Hernandez. Okay, that's very interesting. I don't know if he's going to be fodder or not. Oh my god, what a pack that one is. Theo Hernandez is really good to pick up. I'm quite happy about that. This is the team that we are going to be submitting to complete the 82 times 100. I'm really excited to get this open. Let's go and get it open. So the 82 times 100. Here we go. Please, EA, bless me with my futties. Come on, who's that going to be? It's Oblak who I actually really did want. 97 rated. We finally got a goalkeeper for the rest of the account. Quite happy with that, genuinely. I know that's not a big, big card to get. We've got Gravenberch in there as well. Very nice. Lots of specials. I did also see a team of the week there, which is quite handy. Wow, guys. Wow. Wow. Look at this pack. We've got Park G Sung in there. We've got Kaka. Oh, my God. God, guys, that pack is absolutely amazing. So, guys, another player joins the club now in Marcos Lorente. The premium Futties card makes a lot of sense now that we have Yano Black in net. So, EA released this crazy nanny objective, which requires you to complete 35 completions of the Futties upgrade SBC, which is going to allow you to get all of these fodder packs as well as nanny. I really want to complete this SPC because I think the card looks absolutely amazing. These premium Futties as well, so we'll go straight into the squad. What the hell? We've gone and got George Best. That's out of one of the packs for Nanny. That's crazy. Oh, my God. So, guys, we've gone and completed Lewis Nanny. All 35 completions. I've still got the big packs to open. But out of the 80 times freeze, I didn't really get anything too spectacular. Lovely to add this card into the club, though. Let's go and open the big fodder packs. Oh, we're definitely going to get a lot of duplicates in this. But I don't really care because the amount of fodder that we're going to get from this is going to be bonkers. We're going to get Barella out of the first one. 92 rated, which is genuinely amazing. Look at that for a pack already. Two Champions League Italian cards there, which is just absolutely incredible for the account straight away. Then we've got a, we've got two free 84 pluses. We'll get these cranked out now. We've got a few stars in the first one. It's going to be Banashile. No, it's going to be Kalulu. That's nice. Once again, good fodder. Any futties in here? No. Another future stars in Jed Spence there. It's not too shabby there, actually, either. Um, let's do the two 84 pluses, actually. I shouldn't have done the, the free ones there. We're going to get a Futt Fancy out of this. We're going to get... Is it Trimmel? No, it's a Wolfsburg player. Wimmer. Okay. Once again, 89 rated is very good fodder. And a Sergio Busquets. I'm going to bin him. I've got so much fodder in the club right now anyway that I'm not really too worried about that. We've got another 84 times 2. It's going to have another special in it. It's going to be a Future Stars. It's going to be Jed Spence. And once again, similar to Busquets, I'm not too bothered. I'm not too bothered, honestly. I'm not too bothered about that. But, you know, we're, we're acquiring lots of fodder here, which is absolutely amazing. The free 84 plus here again. It's going to be just golds in this one. There's an opportunity there could be a premium futties in behind here. It's Laporte as the gold walkout. It's going to be Juan Sebastian Veron. I'm not going to waste this Laporte. I'm going to go and throw him into an SBC. So, guys, we threw Laporte into an SBC. We're going to have another icon coming into the club very, very soon. We've got a French Future Stars here. And it's going to be Badashile this time. Who else is going to be in here? Anything special? Harry Kane, which is nice. And Galatsky there, an 85 I'm not too bothered about it. Now, any fodder we do get from this pack here, though, the 84 times 10, we will go out and throw into an SBC. It's going to be a Europa League card. It's probably going to be Voland, right? No, it's Eric Lamella, 91, which is very, very good. Please have some futties in here. That would be amazing for the club. Oh, it's a bad pack, actually. Lenny King's in there. But generally speaking, that's actually quite a bad pack. So then, guys, the new icon that we have added into the club was Rui Costa. I'm really happy to bring him in. He's probably not going to make the start in 11, which is crazy. But he's really cheap to do, and he looks really good. Let's go and give you a squad update. So, guys, time for the squad update. And as you can see, the bench and reserves are insane. Absolutely insanely stacked, guys. Graven Birch. Rui Costa, Nani, and Hernandez aren't even making it into the starting 11, which is bonkers. Same with George Best. Managed to keep hold of Carlson, who I do think is still going to be fodder, but still managed to keep hold of him. 
and we haven't really done that much to even really get this good of a bench so you know we're about four and a half five days into the account and we are now strictly gameplay after i've built this team together and let's go and do that right now straight away starting off with the goalkeeper and that's going to be jan or black of course we did get in at the 82 at times 100 same with graven birch he is very nice in there and our three center backs are going to be as follows so first one is Koulibaly, second one is diego carlos and then the third one is Thomas Delaney. So Diego Collis at the moment is getting no chemistry, but Delaney isn't actually going to play at centre-back. We are sitting up here in a 3-4-3, three, three, but it's not going to set up like that in game. Pretty happy with this back line. You know, they're all Futties cards. They all look absolutely amazing. So very happy with the back line. Another player that we did get from the 82 times 100 is going to be Jisung Park. He is going to go in at right mid. His card actually looks really good. He's really, really cheap. I can't really understand as to why. Our left mid is going to be Thomas Lamar, who we did get from the Futties Cup last week. And once again, he's amazing in game. I really, really like him. So happy for him to join the start at 11. Everybody so far is a Futties card. How crazy is that? The first centre mid is going to be Paul Skulls. And then the second centre mid is going to be Marcos Lorente. So Skulls in the team, of course, an objective. I'm not the biggest fan of him in game, but we are going to use him. It's a shame Rui Costa can't play centre mid because I would play him over Skulls. And Lorente, I love this card because of how many positions he can play. You know, his alternates aren't the best, but he's a really big utility man. So another great card to have in the club. And then the front three, starting off with the left wing. The first one is going to be Cody Gakpo. Now, I really like him because he's got the five-star skills, of course, but he's six foot two. He's kind of got that Cristiano Ronaldo frame in game. So he is going to be very clutch for us, I hope. And our right wing is going to be none other than Musa. I wasn't expecting to keep him in the team. But I actually really like him in game. Five star skills, five foot seven moves really, really quickly. And then the go of the squad is going to be the striker. And that is going to be Petr Cech, guys. An absolute monster on this game. As you probably already know, that is the team that we are rocking. In terms of the custom tactics, we are going to be playing a 4-3-2-1. As you can see, Delaney is playing at left back. We've got Jisung Park playing at right back. With Skulls, Lorente, and Lamar in the midfield. Lorente is going to be the defensive option there. Musa, Gakpo, and Czech up front. So what we're going to do right now, guys, is we're going to go into Fart Champs playoffs, try and get a 10-0, and see where we go from there. All right, then, boys. So the last player to join the team before we get into Fart Champs is going to be cover star icon, 97 rated, Xavi Alonso. I love this card. Happy to bring him into the team. Okay, lads. And then the final thing I've got to do before we actually do get into Champs, I'm not going to show you qualifiers. I'm just going to go 5-0 and give away the rest of the wins or kind of end playoffs. We have got four 87 plus player picks now to try and get a good Futties card into the team. I don't know really what to expect. I'm just kind of hoping for a Futties card that we can add onto the bench or something of that nature. First of all though, boys, these have been absolutely tragic. With Badashiel and Melier being the two cards. Then we've got Felipe Anderson, Tony Kroos, Jesus. Final one is going to contain for us nothing good at all that is really really poor andre shevchenko is now in the club and we have completed fuck champs playoffs so it's now time to get into the real thing and get into fuck champs okay so i made a slight change to the team and brought in rui costa and dropped musa to the bench i think rui costa is going to be quite good because of his passing that's the team we're going to champs with let's get into it all right then so game one coming up now oh it's gonna be light work let's go come on then, rui oh yeah one nil nice oh, that's lovely from chabby alonso Better check. Makes it 2-0 in 8 minutes. This guy should be one goal away from rage quitting. Yes, Rui Costa. 3-0. Let's go. This guy isn't leaving, though. Fair play to him. Yes, let's go, Lamar. 4-0. This guy's gone. Let's get into another game of 1-0. All right, then, guys. Game number two coming up. Let's go. Go on, Lamar. Oh, what a goal that is from Lamar. Come on. This guy's really good, too. Rui Costa. Let's go. 2-0. Deserved. This guy's going to leave as well. That's us 2-0. Looks like he isn't leaving, guys. Damn. He's making some subs. This guy has got Ronaldinho, Vinicius Jr. I assume the 98 and the cover stars Rooney as well. So this guy's got a monster team. Such good FIFA. Such good FIFA. And what a finish from Gakpo as well. And now this guy is going to leave. Let's go. All right, then. Game number three. What are we up against? Let's see what this guy's got for a team. He's got the Man City badge. He's got Oblak. He's got Canate. Oh, God. That's a really good team. Go on, check. 
Go on, check. Yeah, what a finish. This guy's a good player. I know it's early doors, but I can tell he's very good. He's trying to do the kickoff glitch, as you can see right there, and failing. But still, this guy's a good player, so we're going to have to be on our toes. Oh, Alonso. Oh, check. Oh, I didn't think that was going to go in. This guy's going to rage quit as well. We're 3-0. That's a good one to come through. Okay, game number four up against the Mighty Reds. Let's see what he has got for a team. He has got Oblak as well. Okay, so he plays draft. He's got Rodri. It's actually not that big of a team. Hopefully, this will be a quick rage quit as well. Let's go, check. Let's go. Let's go, Gakpo. Let's go. What a goal that is. Oh, my God. What a goal from Xabi Alonso. I love that card, guys. This guy's going to go too. Right then, game number five. We've had to show you every game so far. This guy's got Oblak once again. Virgil, Canate, Alaba, Alonso. Ooh, that is a sick team. Oh, Xabi Alonso again with the ball. It's got to be the first touch of dreams. And Gakpo, there's not enough on it. Oh, that's so annoying. Gak post done really well there. Check is in. Let's go. 1 0 deserved. Oh, that sucks. That sucks so bad. Oh, he scored. Fair enough. Fair enough. Please, Costa. Let's go. Come on. So, guys, we're going into extra time. This has been a really difficult game against a really good player. Fingers crossed we can come through it. I'm not promising anything, though. Please go in. Please go in. Let's go, Costa. Come on. No way. Oh, that's going to be a goal, isn't it? Oh, it's a good chip as well. Fair play to this guy, man. What a player. Oh, pet check. Pet check. Oh, what a goal. What a goal. Honestly, what a goal. And what a sweaty game of FIFA. That's going to be game over. Chef Jack. Oh my god, that almost didn't go in. Let's go though, man. We managed to get through the game just about. This guy was a serious baller. All right, guys, we managed to win that game. That is unbelievable. That was such a good game of FIFA. I really enjoyed playing it. We are now 5 or 6 and 0, which is absolutely brilliant. All right, then, game number six now coming up. Hopefully, an easier game than that last one. That was very, very stressful. Everybody's got our black and everybody's got Canate right now. Jesus. Go on, Rui. Rui's in. Rui scores. Let's go. Costa's been really, really good for us, guys. Oh, he's equalised by the cutbacks. Oh, dear. Oh, he scored. I thought he was going to go for the cutback again. This game's turned around in a heartbeat. Oh, this guy is so good at passing in the box, man. We're 3-1 down. This might be the first loss. Let's go, Costa. I didn't think that was going to go. I thought the scoop turn wasn't going to get past him. Let's go. We're back in the game. Please, Rui, come on. We're back in the game again. Alonso, come on. We're back in the game. We're back in the game. Oh, it's lovely. Shevchenko's in. Shevchenko! Come on, man. Let's go. Oh, my God. Let's go. Come on. Is he going to rage quit? No chance. He has. Oh, my God. What a comeback. Another go of our black. We've just made that amazing comeback. We are on at the ascendancy up the ranks. Let's go and get a win here. Better check. Bangs it. Oh, let's go. Oh, Gakpo. Oh, that's an absolutely brilliant goal. Oh, Rui Costa. Let's go, man. 3-0 in 14 minutes. This guy's going to go. Very easy game, that one. All right, game number eight. This guy's called Edge Runners FC. What has he got for a team? Oblak? No, Tapsoba this time. Canate, Cooley Daddy, Son, Graven Birch, Lorente, Mkhitaryan. Abraham, that's a really good team. Hopefully, let's go and win this. Gakpo, let's go, man. We've deserved that goal massively. Oh, my God. That's tough. Mm, that's really tough. One breakaway. It's his first shot as well, man. Please check. Petter, check. Let's go straight from kickoff. He is a god, guys. Petter, check. Let's go, man. 3-1. Another rage quit, man. We are dominating champs right now. All right, game number nine. These games have been a little bit stressful, but a lot easier than I thought they were going to be for this level. This guy's got a crazy good team. Oh, my God. He's got Mbappe. Jesus. Go on in, Rui. Please, Rui. Let's go. 1-0 straight away. 
Pet check. That's a goal. Let's go. Let's go check. This guy's going to rage quit as well, guys. We are absolutely dominating champs. Game number 10, guys. We are I'm currently 9-0. This guy's got a pretty basic team. Go on, Gakpo. Oh, what a goal. Oh, Petter check is a joke, man. Honestly. He's left. He's left. We're 10-0, guys. Unreal. So, lads, at this point, I decided to take a break from champs. We were 10-0. We went and claimed Tejon Buchanan. And then we had all of these objectives to open from the fuck champs bonus. So then guys, we've got a monster little pack opening to do here. I think I wanna go and complete Roberto Carlos. So I think with the fodder we're gonna get from this, I might see if I can get him done. It might be a bit of a push, but fingers crossed. I'm not gonna keep all of this kind of stuff. We might go and do an icon player pick. It depends how much fodder we do manage to get from all of this. We have got a lot of 85 times 10s, a lot of stuff here to open, and hopefully we can get a 40s or two as well. So we're starting off with golds, in the stinky packs, it's Rodri and Carrasco, which isn't too bad. I want to go and open all of the stuff before the 85 times 10. So a free 84 plus players pack, probably going to have a special in it. It's going to be a future stars as it usually is. No futties really coming out of these. Another Gerard Moreno as well, which is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. And then the final little pack, if you can call them small little packs. I'm not really sure if you can. It's going to be a fuck birthday. It's going to be Piscina, I believe. Any futties in here? No, there's a good amount of fodder in there, though, with Harry Kane and Lewandowski, which is all right. And now it's time for the 85 times 10s. I might have to cut you and bring you back, depending on what we do get for fodder. We're going to be getting a Champions League card in the first one. It's going to be Calvin Phillips, who actually does have quite a good card. But we don't really care for him, do we, if we're being honest? Lots of very nice fodder in there. That's going to be really good for either the icon pick or for Roberto Carlos. And then the second one is going to contain a conference league card. That's going to be Ben Rama? No, a Tau. Okay. We haven't got a lot of duplicates so far, which is nice and quite handy because I don't want to cut you away and then bring you back. I want you to see all of the packs all in one. Third, 85 times 10. Probably going to get some dupes in this one. It's going to be a future stars as the walkout. It's going to be French. It's going to be centre back. Is that Kalulu or Badashile? One of the two. 100%. It was Kalulu. So once again, only one card there as fodder. Of course, we're taking a break from champs right now to open all of these packs. And then the final 85 times 10. It's going to have an inform in it. That's actually quite nice. It's going to be Dutch centre-back. Is that Delict? Yeah, that's nice. 89 or 90 rated Delict there is very, very juicy. No futties in here, though, unfortunately. Once again, only one duplicate, and it's that god damn Gerard Moreno again. So, guys, I didn't have enough fodder to go and do Bobby Carlos, so I've gone and done the 90-plus icon player pick. I doubt we'll get anything good, but there is hope there. Come on, let's go. EA, please. Wow. Wow, I feel like that's quite good. Robin Van Persie. Five-star skill. I think that's very, very good. Oh, my God. Is he, isn't he worth, like, a load of coins? Wow. Still 400k on him, guys. I am really, really happy with that. Okay, so this is game number 11 now. We had our little break, and we are 10 and 0. This guy's got Tapsoba, Canate. Oh, everybody's got the same team, really, haven't they? That's a really, really nice one, though. Oh, I love you, Petacek. I actually love Petacek so much. He is carrying me so, so, so hard. Petacek. Let's go, Check. How's that gone in? Oh, my God. Oh, he's got one back. He's got one back. That's a good goal. It's all right, actually. Good play from him. Oh, just like that, he's got himself back into the game. Oh, how in God's name. Rashford hat-trick. I cannot believe it. Please, Petter. Petter, you're better than everyone, mate. I swear down. Damn, this guy is so good when he's in the box. I can't even lie, man. He is so hard to get the ball off. Petter check. Oh, he's got a score. What a save from Tapsoba, man. Please, Van Percy. Why is he hit it like that? Oh, he's costing me. Why is he shot like that, man? Please, Van Per... Oh, Ruby Costa. Oh, he is actually class. It's time for Van Percy to make up for his mistakes. What a ball from Chabby. Van Percy. Yes. Oh, that's on Van Percy. Yes, come on. Van Percy again. Oh. oh, my God. Oh, my God. What a goal, boys. What a goal. 
All right, lads, another game comes to an end. That guy was really, really good. So I'm happy to come through that. And winners at 7-4 were 11-0. Game number 12. We are getting close to the promised land. If we can get a rank to a rank one, I will be over the moon. Come on, let's go. Three cost up. Three goal. We got quite lucky there, but I'll take it. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Petr check again. Three cost up. Let's go, man. Three nil. This guy's gone. We are absolutely cruising. So guys, next game is up. I forgot what we are. I think we're 12-0, and 0, but I can't remember exactly. Hopefully, we can go and get this rank one. How amazing would that be? Oof. How's he got in there? Oh, dear. Oh, I see you, Gakpo. I see you all. Oh, let's go. Come on. Oh, Chevy Alonso. Oh, that is an absolutely ridiculous goal. We are halfway to concede. Oh, he's bottled it. Oh my! Oh my word! No, no way. Is that a penalty? No way. Okay, this is game one. If he scores this, let's go, O Black. Get to it, O Black. Oh my word! My players are all absolute bots, man. Oh, this is stressful now, boys. That was the hardest game of the lot, guys, but we've managed to come through it with our 13-0. Game number 14. What has this guy got for a team? He's got the Ajax badge, which does actually concern me. Oh, he's got a good back line. He's got a good midfield. He's got Ronaldinho. Okay. Oh, and Messi. Oh, dear. Oh, good goal, man. Good goal. Come on, Marie. Let's go, Costa, man. This is such a sweaty game, guys. Oh, my God. Oh, my word. Oh, this is too sweaty, guys. Oh, my God, Shevchenko. Oh. Grab Birch. Check. What the hell is going on? Oh, we've won it. We've won it at the depths of some absolute BS. I cannot believe that, guys. We deserved a bit of luck there, but that is crazy. What a sweaty game of FIFA. All right, game number 15 and the game for Muriel. If we can win this, guys, we're going to get Muriel into the club. What's this guy got for a team? He's got Canate. Everybody's got Canate. That team's really good. Let's hope you go pick up a dub. Rui Costa. Let's go. Let's go, man. Let's go. Oh, we've got so lucky. We've got so lucky. I'm going to take it, though. Eight minutes in, 2 0 up. Let's go, Gakpo. Let's go, man. This guy should be leaving, really. Oh, pet check. Oh, my God. What a goal. This guy's gone. We are 15-0. and 0. So, guys, that means Muriel joins the club and he's going to go straight onto the bench. Okay, guys. So, this is the 16th game and officially the game for rank three. Man, if we get even rank three on a seven-day RTG, I think that's crazy. This guy's got an awesome team. He's got Ronald Dinge. Let's get into the game and hopefully pick up the dub. Pet check should be getting to that. Pet check. Let's go. 1-0. Come on. Rui Costa, 2-0. Let's go, man. Alonso makes it 3-0. I love that Alonso, guys. This guy's gone. We're now officially 16-0. And then it was crunch time. Okay, guys. So now this is where it's going to start getting really stressful and really sweaty at 16-0. What's this guy got for a team? Tap Soba, Carte, Carlos, Ronaldinho again. That's not the best team in the world. I've played better this weekend. Hopefully, we can get the job done. Go on, Lamar. Let's go, Lamar. Come on. Wow, that's a crazy goal. Fair play. Oh, fair enough, man. He's turned this game around so quickly. Wow, this guy's so good. Fair enough. Let's go, Rui Costa. Man, this is one hell of a sweaty game once again. Fair check. Come on, man. Let's go. This guy is so good at doing that, man. Recycling the play like that. Honestly, what a game of FIFA, man. Muriel's in. Luis Muriel. Let's go. Come on. So, so sweaty, lads. Alonso. Alonso. Oh, my God. He's offside. He's offside. Oh, that must have been so close. Oh, my God, boys. Yeah, that's tough, lads. That's tough. I don't think we deserve to lose that game. But there you go. That's the way the cookie crumbles sometimes. We're now 16-1. and one.
All right, guys. So we're 16 and one. If we come up against somebody that sweaty, I'd be very, very surprised. This guy's, of course, got a monster team at 16 and one. He's got check up front. He has got Neymar's 99. Let's hopefully go and get it. Come on, Rui. Please, let's go, man. We need to hold on to this lead because this guy is a demon, lads. Please, Costa. Oh, my God. He's missed it. He's missed it. Oh, he moved the keeper out of the way for me, too. Hold on. Please. Let's go check. We deserve that. Oh, my word. This is crazy, crazy stuff. Please leave. Please, please, please leave. Let's go, man. 17 and 1. So we need one more win to complete the road to glory. We need at least rank 2 to complete this entire RTG. If not, we have to discard the entire team. So fingers crossed we can get the win here. It would also be lovely to get a rank 1. But this is a game for rank 2. Oh, he's 1-0 one, one up already. Mkhitaryan. I don't know how he's managed to get that space there. Please, Alonso. Let's go, shabby Alonso, man. How, man? How? I feel like I've tackled him so much there. This is a really, really annoying game. I'm dominating it, but just a uh, just, uh, guy's costing me at the moment. Oh, my God, guys. Oh, this is really, really tough. This has to go, Muriel, man. This has to go, Muriel. Come on, we're back in the game. We've deserved that big time. Van Persie, come on, man. Really quick, really quick two goals there. Back in it. Oh, my God, what a pass, Alonso. Uriel's actually in here, isn't he? Uriel! Oh, how, how has he missed that, boys? I do not have a Scooby. Oh, my God. Van Persie, let's go, man. Let's go. 18 and 1. have won it right at the death there. Let's go. So it all comes down to this. Can we achieve a rank one in fuck champs in six days? Not even seven days on this account. I don't know. Let's find out in this game. That's a really, really good team. Let's go and get the dub. Checks in. Checks in. Pet check. Oh my God. What a save. We've greened it as well. Oh my God. This could be a liquid goal. It's an absolutely beautiful goal. Let's go. Pass one all. Fair play. Fair play. Good goal there. Pet check. Let's go, man. Come on. I'm actually so nervous, I can't even lie. But I'm starting to get a bit shaky, you know? I mean, I'm a little bit weak. Oh, that's game. That's game. Lamar, let's go. 3 1. Game over. We should have rank one from here, guys. We should have rank one. Oh, Van Percy. Let's go. That's game over, guys. This guy's going to leave. That is rank one achieved. Let's go. All right, boys, let's just go through here and show you that it is rank one. 77 out of 80 points. Unbelievable. So then, guys, let's open the rewards and see what we do get. We should get some futties in these as well. So fingers crossed. Starting off with a Sergio Biscuits there. Not too good. Second pick is going to have in for us Alexis Sanchez 94, which actually isn't that bad, to be fair. Third one is going to contain lots of specials, none that we can use, of course, but Lucas Moore is the option there. And the final one for us is going to have Fofana in it. So we've got all the gold cards there, or the gold player picks, I should say. And now we have got the one of five shapeshifter, prem shapeshifter, or FX tot. So there's lots in this. There is lots and lots of stuff in this. We've got Chris Smallin in there. I'm Chris Smallin. Luka Modric, Dembele, Casemiro and Tolisso. So not the best pick in the world. We are going to take Luka Modric in that one. The second one coming up now is going to have for us pretty stinky again. We're going to go for Becker in that one. That's quite disappointing so far. And then the third one for us is going to contain stinkers once again. We're going to take Martinelli there in case you want to do any SBCs. They weren't the best. Okay, guys, and now we've got some juicy packs to open. We've got a 50k and ultimate pack, and then the FX pack, as well as two 84 times fives, I believe. We've got Benacer here in the 50k pack, which isn't too shabby, actually. And then Jonathan Tarr and a Libertadores card. The ultimate pack should have some good stuff in it for us. If you get a gold card as your walkout here, you've absolutely stunk up the place. We are not going to get a gold card, it's going to be a fantasy fart. Brazilian CDM, it's going to be Fernando, I do believe. Yep. Fernando, there could still be some butties in here, though, if we get a little bit lucky. There is not. Trent's in there, Patricio. Quite a stinker, actually, for a pack. And then we have the 92 plus FX 
tradable pack. Come on EA, please hook me up with something that's actually worth some bread. It's gonna be a premium shapeshifters. I think that's Gertzer, sure, isn't it? That's really bad. That's really, really bad. It's got Pepe and Brant in there as well. So a really, really stinky pack there as well. I'm not gonna to complain too much. You know, at the end of the day, we've gotta got a rank one. Our team is crazy. And we have got two 84 plus times fives to open to finish off the RTG. And maybe we'll go and do a few things in the SBC menu in terms of fat packs and stuff. Just to finish off what a pack that is as well. My word, fair play, yeah. you really, really are hooking me up there. A rank one on a seven day RTG, done in six days as well, by the way. And we can't get any good rewards from rank, rank one fuck champs. Really, really disappointing, really disappointing. There you go, that's a bit better, but still, overall, not the best rewards in the world. All right, guys, and this is the way we're gonna finish off the account in terms of packs. I'll show you the team after we've done these. We have got five of the one of four 90 plus tots, tots moments, shapeshifter, or Fatty's player picks. One of four, so we should get some good stuff in these, you'd hope. Starting off with Lorenzo Insigne is very nice. I don't know how much he's worth, but it's still an awesome pickup straight away. And then we're gonna get Jonathan Klaus. I know he does have a Fatty's card as well, but still a nice one to bring in. Third one is going to have Molina in it. Fourth one, have we got anything juicy? Come on, a Fatty's. There you go, Javi Simmons in this one. That's unreal. And then the fifth one is going to have Casemiro in it. That's unbelievable, guys. Let's go and check out the team. So then, guys, this is the team that we did use in champs, and this is the bench that we now do have as well. As you can see, crazy bench with Gravenberg, Shevchenko, Van Persie, Skulls, Musa, Nani, and Muriel. And on the reserves, we have Insigne, Simmons, Perisic, Team of the Hernandez, and Fuck Birthday Best. And this is the team that did get us to rank one. We did start off with Musa instead of Rui Costa, but I thought Rui Costa would be a little bit better, and it turned out he was. He was brilliant for us. If you guys can tell me in the comment section down below before we go to the MVP of the team, who that MVP was, that would be brilliant, guys. We have two MVPs in this team, and the first one is going to be Chabi Alonso. He was ridiculous for me. His passing was crazy. I highly, highly recommend you go and grab him for your team. And then the other MVP, wasn't going to be anybody else, was Petter check 37 games 50 goals and 17 assists he is still absolutely broken man honestly what a team this was in terms of the way we played with it it was set up like this in game so check out front Gakpo and Rui Costa and the center forward spots Lamar and Alonso as the outside center mids and then Lorente as the defensive option Jisung Park and Delaney as the fullbacks they were both amazing as well Diego Carlos and Koulibaly with Jan Oblak and Net. Also, one more thing to say about the team, and I'd highly recommend, you're not going to see this actually before the draft objectives go, but this card is unreal as well, guys. I really, really enjoyed him at left back. Crazy, crazy card, guys. This team was unbelievable. I can't believe we managed to get a rank one in about six days, so we didn't even fulfill the seven days. Of course, because we got rank one or rank two for that matter, we've managed to avoid having to go into division rivals. We are currently in division four and division rivals, so... No more of that needed, guys. Let me know what you thought to the team. Let me know if you've ever seen a better seven-day RTG. But, guys, if you did enjoy it as well, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and turn on the bell so you miss a video like this. But, guys, that's going to be it from me for now, so take care.